What's up, YouTube? Pink Reaver here, back for more uh, Mega Man Battle Network. So here we are in World 3 Area 2. World World 3 Comp 2. Um, this one uh, was spitting out bubbles at us, so clearly it must have Bubble Man in it. Um, but what's this? It's filled with electric enemies? And here we have a new enemy, or somewhat new enemy, Elebees. Um, I hate Elebees. I really do, and I hope I can... Yes! Um, Elebees are so freaking annoying. They're constantly disappearing, making them very hard to actually hit. Um, and then they teleport into your area and attack you. I don't like dealing with them. Oh. Let's try, Let's try not to get grabbed. Let's come over here. And, uh, one of these two areas has an alpha bug on it. I think it's actually this way. Yep. I was right. Um... So we go this way. That is why I saved there. Oh no, here's a fun one. There's alpha bugs all- th or alpha, like, puddles all throughout this particular area, so... Um... This is kind of a bother here. What? Now we go. You need to get over here, because that first one has an alpha on it. Oh! Bad time to get into battle. Success. Plant man chip. Plant man chips. Um, this will at least get rid of the... LB is pretty quickly, and it'll take care of the Canadum enemy as well. Uh, maybe I can get another um, Canada or Cannon Three chip. Cannon Three R, which is I think the one I already have. Whew. Okay, so we just avoided that. Now there's another Alpha on that first one, I believe. So I want to go down here. Yeah, they slow down when they're in this area for some reason. And I got a rag up too. I think this is the last regular memory upgrade you find in this game. Um, I don't think there's any more to find in the uh, the world. Oh, so we have a we have a slimer and a slimy and a nailer. But uh, once again, Plant Man cares not. Yeah, my folder's a lot better than it used to be. Oh, go 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 go! Don't get grabbed. Okay. So heading over here. Let's uh, change the folder just a little bit. Let's go ahead and take that out. And let's put in a rock cube. Because I'm going to need it. And let's go ahead and set it to normal. Or regular. Save. And let's go for the fight with Bubbly Man. So it's Bubble Man, so it's Mega Man. Are you, oh you, oh you for being mean to me, Blub Blub. That Mega Buster hurt. So did Proto Man's sword. How would you know? You were dead. Wily apparently made him stronger than he was before. That's not quite true, because you're still in alpha form. <laughs> uh, oh, so here's a thing. If I use both Rock Cube and Time Bomb, since only two objects can actually be on one side of the field at any given time, It'll uh, get rid of the first object that was there, which is that boulder that's already there. So I'm actually going to not, not do that. Um, let's get a little extra damage on him, and there we go. Uh, this will not be a difficult fight. Uh, ow! I say that, and then I get hit. Oh, no, darn it. Go back down. Oh, I can't see the crabs again. Stupid invisible crabs. Whoa. Invisible crabs make me angry. Definitely can't use these chips. Well, I could use invis, but... Um, so there is his uh, bubble armor, but he won't actually... Sh uh, he can't actually hit us, so he won't actually shoot. Um, you know what? I might as well just... Once I get a Plant Man chip, this battle will end anyways. Yeah, see, he won't actually shoot at us, and now he won't actually throw, um... He won't throw any of those crabs anymore, either, so it's pretty easy. Actually, pretty easy from here. Oh, let's just do this. Zeta Cannon 2. Wow, can I really not hit you with this? I can't. Wow, that's retarded. Um... Whatevers. I can definitely hit you with this. 
Or rather, I can hit you with the next one. Oh, I didn't think that would actually hit. Bam. We're done. But there seems to be a path behind him. I can't believe you blub beat me again. Just you wait. Alpha will absorb you. Blub blub blah, and then he dies. Nope, robot's still going. Bubble Man was not operating it. Well, clearly there has to be a, like a human operating it. So now we head over here. Oh, okay, this is a really annoying part. I always have trouble with this part. Ah, uh, ah, uh, yeah. Not the easiest thing to deal with right here. Ah! Ah, let me reset. There we go. Um, I need to get that blue mystery data. It's actually necessary. Ah, come on. All of the objects on screen make it hard to see the shadows, so... Um, it can be kind of annoying trying to get in there. Oh, never mind. I actually didn't need to get that. I thought it was a necessary one. Um, oh well. So, I hate, I hate, I hate. Screw the alpha program, there needs to be something to stop this. Also, apparently this game was made in 2003, or 2002, because I just, I just noticed the Capcom, uh, uh, oh come on! The, uh, Capcom copyright right there, I would mentioned earlier, I didn't know where it was, oh my god, this is pissing me off, this is making me angry. This is legitimately, LEGITIMATELY making me angry. <laughs> you know what? I'm just gonna go over here. And I'm gonna go right- Oh my god! You know what? Fine. Fine. Be that way. I swear to god, I don't care. Um. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! How am I doing so poorly at this right now? Really? Really? I'm- I'm just going to- I'm going to cry. I'm going to cry! Ah! There we go! Shoot! Um... There's actually another alpha over here. I'll show it off. Um... In case you're playing along with me and you also don't want to use the alpha program, but you don't know where they are, that's where he is. Okay, this is the necessary blue data. Oh, it's a Mega Bunny! I don't know if I've shown off Mega Bunnies. Um, but I don't really intend to, because I just realized I still have Rock Cube set as my regular chip. Um, let's go ahead and put that mine back in. I really wish you could get Asterisk Mines. There are Asterisk Mine chips, and you will get a lot of them later in the game. Um, yes, there's more to the game, despite the fact that we're at the end. Um, where is the mine chip? Oh, it'll be down there, I forgot. Um, like... Mines in this game are just really good. 300 damage. And look, only 16 megabytes for the, uh... To make it a regular chip. Um... Like, don't underestimate that chip. It's it's a very good chip. Um... So going over here, we can use that to open this door. And then we have an even more annoying arrangement of these things. Uh, just because they're kind of pseudo-random over here. Not even gonna bother with you guys. And then I get grabbed anyway. Ah, that's why I hate random battles right here. I should have the decency to remove random battles in this area. No. Don't want to deal with you guys right now. And over here we have... Nothing? Hiss hiss. Uh, yeah. It's, uh... It's Desert Man. Desert Man and Sunayama. He just slowly strolls over here. But weren't you arrested by the officials? Lord Wily hacking the system and freed me, and it's it's good <laughs> so good to be back. Now I can watch TV again. You bet to delete those who stand in the way of Lord Wily's plan. Tron wouldn't even tell me the ratings of the N1. Think an official would keep his promises. You no, know, you really think he would. That's uh that's pretty messed up, Chod. You deleted his navy, sent him to prison, and then didn't even keep your promise. So yeah, they go full synchro as well. Gutsman, help out. So here's Gutsman. Apparently, uh... 
an earthquake can still damage him, I guess. So here he is. Desert Man. So yes, it's just like Flash Man, it's just Desert Man out. Oh my god, really? That's what you opened me up with? Um, well, okay. I'm not gonna turn it down. The big problem here being that, uh, I can only actually hit him once with each of these shots, because he's gonna... He's gonna go... He's gonna get all scared. Um, uh, wait. Let's do this. Oops. Yeah, not very good there. Um, Plant Man, on the other hand, will be very good. But first, let's go ahead and add this. Um, oh, actually, Plant Man react. Uh, Desert Man reacts kind of oddly to Plant Man. Um, I guess I can show that off. We'll destroy all the hands. So yeah, he doesn't actually disappear. Which is good, because it actually makes him hittable. But then, as soon as the, uh... As soon as the, uh, vines go away, he disappears right away. Um... I don't know, I always felt like he... Oh, I thought I got him. I always thought felt like he should, um... He should disappear under the sand every time the vines hit him. Uh, what do I want to do here? Let's do this. You know what? Screw it. Let's just do this. <laughs> Might as well. Because then I can just do this and end it. Let's destroy everything, though. Both his hands. There we go. So yeah, not a particularly difficult fight or anything here. And with that, Desert Man is gone. So now that's, that's over with, once again, we have another friend we can battle. Um, we can actually now net battle um, Guts Man for his alpha form, apparently, again. Um, even though we have fought Beta Guts Man, um, I don't know why they give us alpha form here again. I want to counter hit. I want those bug frags I get from a counter hit. And Plant Man will make it easy. I do, however... Oops. Um, there we go. This will get you a counter hit if he's in this backswing right here. And an easy 10 bug frags right there. So this is how I will actually be grinding bug frags from now on. Um, if I need bug frags, I'm just going to come over here, challenge Dex, and keep beating him over and over again for 10 bug frags. Um, it's definitely the best way to do it. Um, let's just get some really good damage on him right away. Um, shoot. Now I actually can't use anti-damage or it'll kill him. Um. Although if I wanted Gutsman version 4, I could use it. But I don't really care about Gutsman version 4 right now. Um, it's not that great of a chip, to be completely honest. This will work out nicely, though. And I'll still probably get Gutsman version 4 for this. Um. Yeah, there we go. Yes, I got a Gutsman 4. Um, Gutsman 4 is probably the worst version 4 chip in the game. Um, you see it only has 100 power. Gutsman 3 actually has 90, so it's only a 10 power increase over Gutsman version 3. Um, yeah, and it does exactly the same thing. It doesn't get any added benefits or anything like that. It's exactly the same as Gutsman 3, 3 just slightly more powerful. Um, but yes, that is how I will be, uh, grinding my, my bug frags from now on. Um, I actually can beat him much faster than that if I want. It's just, um, 
I'm gonna need a slightly better folder for it. What's that noise? Huh? Oh, it's that boulder. I got some Indiana Jones stuff going on right here. Run, land. Why aren't you rolling? You have roller skates on. Rolling would be faster. That was close. Chod! Chod is surrounded by fire. Why are you surrounded by fire, Chod? Go on. Through the door. What are you talking about? I'm going to help you. Don't worry about me. You have to delete Alpha now. This is to protect all of us. And protect us all. How can I help the entire world if I can't help a friend? There's no way I'm going to leave you behind. Come on, Mega Man. Oh, man. It's a tank that shoots fire? I wonder who's in control of this one. It's probably Drill Man. Um. Alright, not that way. Uh, there's an alpha bug in here. So go that way. Go this way. Um, this is also the area where you find um, uh, mashers, or bashers, or thrashers, I can't remember what they're called. They're the enemies that give you the magnum chips, and those are what I'm looking for. Um, you get the jungle program here too, which helps you find grass type en enemies. Um, I'm actually going to... Um, Oh, actually, I just found one. Cool. I don't actually have to look then. Um, I was going to say I'm going to... Um, I'm just going to cut until I found the uh, the enemy I'm looking for to get the chip I want. Um, which I'm going to have to, though. Because I uh, I did not get it there. Yeah, I'm just going to cut and I'm just going to keep going until I get a Magnum 1 uh, A chip. So I will be back when I get that. Okay, that took forever. Um... I ended up actually having to put collect on to get that. Like, I was having that much trouble. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and remove everything here. Um, and let's restart myself here. I'm going to take uh, fast gauge off completely, and you will understand why in a bit. Uh, for the time being, we're gonna go with... Um, well, I gotta have press. Like, that's just a, a prerequisite, really. Uh, let's do it like that. Um, and you know what? Let's put on Meg Folder 1. Um, let's add another Mega Folder, or Mega Chip into our folder. And let's go ahead and put on the Charge Chip. Charges. Put on the Weapon Levels. I did that wrong. Uh, I did that very wrong, apparently. There we go, that works. Um, where's the other weapon level? Weapon level. There you are. Um, is there anything else I really want on right now? Actually, I would kind of like collect. Um, is there a way I can... Hmm. Yeah, I can do this. Um, just gonna move these for right now. Wait, maybe I can't make this work. Um, wait, yes, I can. I can do that. And then I can actually do this. There's no way I can also fit press on here is the problem. If I could though, that'd be awesome. Is there anything else I can fit on here? Nah, that's just fine. I don't necessarily need press right now. Um, now that we have that, we're going to leave. We're literally just going to leave Chod. Um, and we're going to go all the way back, and we're going to get that last tome I did not have. I really, really want that tome, and you will understand why when I get it. Um, so I will meet you when we get back to the Undernet. Alright, so here we are back in the Undernet. So you came back? Relax, I still got the old book. So yes, give him the Magnum 1A, and you get the Sky Tome. I just don't get it. Sky, Land, and Sea. Three layers of significance. What's this piece of paper mean by that? Sick. Anyway, some riddle. Beats me. So... Looking at the three items here, if I can get to them, here we are. 
Sky Tome, Land Tome, and Sea Tome. Um, I have no way of showing this off, but you see these little black ticks on top of them? Or under them? Uh, if you arrange those ticks, like those actual markers, um, above each other with sky on top, land in the middle, and sea at the bottom, it forms the Japanese characters for Haniwa, um, as in a Haniwa statue. Um, there's literally no way for us to know this in America, because um, that was something that was uh, given as information during the um, Japanese uh, broadcasting of the Mega Man Battle Network anime, uh, along with specific error codes, which is why you can only find them online now. Um, that... It was, uh, those things were taken out of the, um, American, American version of the anime, so there's no way for us Americans to actually get them. But, um, the Hanawa statue it's talking about is this thing right here. A strange statue given by Shady Antique Stealer. When you sh shake it, something rattles around inside. Land, take out those old tomes we got. They had some strange markings on them, right? The same markings are on the statue. Look, the markings from the three tomes are right there. Let's see what's inside. Aw, oh, it's just some old chip data. But look, this data is for a huge amount of cash. We got 300,000 zennies. Yes. If you examine that statue while you have all three tomes still in your possession, that is, you haven't given them back yet, you get 300,000 zenny. Uh, extremely nice. There's not a lot left for us to buy in the game, but the stuff that is left is extremely expensive. So it's very good to have that kind of money on us. Um, but we're not done with those tomes yet. We are going to take them down to a... Or no, I mean, we are done with those tomes now, so now we're going to take them to, uh, Hades Isle. Oh, shoot, I do need press. Um, whatever. Off with you. On with you. Okay. Did I already buy the... No, I did not buy the ticket. So off the beach area we go. So now when you actually go to the uh, the boat, rather than taking you directly to Hades Isle, it will actually ask you where you want to go. Um, and obviously we want to go to Hades. We come over here. Oh, even Hades Isle is drab now. Um, Coming over here. We can finally give these three tomes away and get get the chip I want from them. If we go over this way. We talk to this fine Oh darn it. And we talked to this fine gentleman. You brought them to me? Ah, uh, yes. Nobody can touch them now. They're mine forever. You've done a great job, Navi. Here, take your reward. We get a chip for Fast Gauge Asterisk. Yes! Um, this is a chip that does the exact same thing as the program. Um, and it only requires 40, uh, 40 megabytes of, um, um, regular memory to make a regular chip. So I can actually set it as my regular chip right now. Um, that is why I went ahead and took off Fast Gauge. Um, extremely, extremely useful chip. It's so great to have. I love it. Um, one time when I was playing this game, in fact, when I was using one of the chip traders, either the 10 or the 3, I can't remember, um, I actually, um, I actually managed to get a Fast Gauge chip out of it, and if you trade that Fast Gauge chip into the, um, chip trader, or if you just buy a new one from, a uh, Higsby, uh, you always get the asterisk code, too, so, like, oh, I was so happy when that happened. I got it so early in the game. Although, at the time, I didn't have enough regular memory to actually use it, so I had to just, like, have it in there, but still, just even having it in there is great. Um, so now that we have that, I honestly even don't care about customizing Mega Man right now, now that I have that. Like, um, I will be putting Collect on again, more than likely, um, uh, because... There are some Navi chips I'm going to be going for later, and I, I'm going to be going for all of their, like, S1s, through, or I mean, their, um, their version 1 through 4 chips, so. Um, going back over this way. 
to get back into this comp. So I save right here is when I actually accidentally get grabbed. And oh, which side has alpha? I think it's this side, maybe. I don't even care about you guys. You know what? I don't... Well, might as well show off fast gauge while we're here. So here's what, how fast gauge works. And you're done. Your custom gauge now moves faster. It's exactly what you think it would be. Ah, so good. And you don't need to use a program for it. Which is good because uh, later in the game I will be using... Um, I will be using a program that takes up the majority of the, the customizer sc uh, space. So it's good to have that extra space. Uh, yeah, I was going to say, there's, alphas hit there's two alphas hidden in that area. I'm trying to remember where they both are. I think the other one's up... No? I... Where is it? Maybe there's only one. Huh. Could have sworn there were two alphas there, but okay. So we have to wait for these guys to get back. And we have to walk with them, unfortunately. Ah, oh, here's a good one. I don't know why I selected that, uh, time bomb. There we go. Bam! Plant Man version 4. Um, I really... I'm really upset. I need different versions of Canadum 3. Right now, all I have is Canadum R... Uh, or Canon 3 R. Oh yeah, now you give me one really easily. Um, I only have Canon 3 R. And I want the other codes for it, but like... I just can't get them right now. I keep S-ranking them as the problem. Um, but I'll go get those in a bit. Oh, right, I forgot. I actually still have to keep moving with these guys. You know what? I'll just let him grab me. It's not that big of a deal. Let's come back around over here. Oh, wait, actually, what am I doing? It's cool. I'll let you grab me again. I don't care. Uh, this actually takes me back to where I need to be. I need to go over here. Um, I can't get that blue mystery data right now. I don't believe so, because I think it's a... F no, actually, I think it's a Navi customizer program. Nope, it is a full energy. Okay. Uh, yeah, it's a full energy. I just can't take it right now. Should we run? Yes. Nothing down there. And more annoying things. Uh, I don't like... I don't like... I don't, I don't, I don't like. These things are annoying. Ah. This is so bothersome. There we go, okay. So here we have a fun one. We have both Aneta and Match. Um. So just like you'd expect, we... We do have to battle both of these navvies, however, we don't have to battle them at the same time. Uh, it's just one right after the other. Uh, I don't know if they ever introduced, like, multiple navvies um, as, like, an actual battle um, in any of the later games. I mean, I've only played up to four, so I don't know if they have in five and six. Uh, but I know throughout four, you never actually have multiple, like, multiple story... Or not story navvies, but, like... Unique navvies in any given fight. Not fair, it's called strategy. Um, so our first fight is actually with Plant Man, but it's only Plant Man um, normal, so it's not even really that big of a deal. Um, um, in this one, I don't believe he has his... Um, he even ha has his Leaf Shield ability, so... Well, now. Almost, oops. I wanted to add, actually. Bam, gotcha. Uh, let's go ahead and add. I want to see if I can get the element sword and just kill him with that. Bam, what's up? Bam, what's up? Uh, let's go ahead and add that. Oh, it doesn't look like it's going to happen. You know what might happen? If I can get him... There we go. That's what I was looking for. Uh, 
Oh, darn it. Well, whatever. Oh, actually, let's do this. Because Bamboo Sword paralyzes, then Fire Sword actually hits him. Nope. Nope. Oh, there's the other one. Gotcha. Yeah, Plant Man, not the hardest boss when he's only at basic. I mean, heck, I S-ranked him be <laughs> I S ranked him in under 20 seconds uh, back when I didn't even have, like, usable chips. Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and do this. Get rid of both of those flames right away. And again, it's just Flame Man version 1, so it's not a huge deal. Ooh. This is the only negative to having uh, Fast Gauge set as my regular, is every time I use Folder Back, it's always going to be there. And at that point, it's useless, because Fast Gauge does not stack. Oh, darn it. Um. I did that wrong. There we go. You know, I want that evil cut more than I want anything else right now. And I still don't have it. I do have Bubble Man, though, and Bubble Man is a... Oh, wait, screw that. <laughs> uh, ooh, got him just before he became invincible. Um, man, at this point, I don't even need Evil Cut. This will do a lot of damage. Ah... Uh, Flame Man, you should be harder. You really should, but... Bam! Counter hit. Not that I get anything for that, but... Even if you can beat us, you'll never defeat Alpha. Alpha will awaken soon, so hot, and they, they both die. I just killed them. How's Trod doing? I'm jacking out now, Mega Man. Trod's fine. So we go over here, and behind these cables, we find a hidden passage. And over here, we have the door to Dr. Wily. Mega Man, no hub. We'll always be together, right? Of course we'll be, we will. Together forever, forever and ever. Thanks. Let's go, Mega Man, to our final battle. Roger. What? Yeah, only not? Okay, now this one's definitely controlled by Drill Man. Draken now, I will delete you. <laughs> He's not even like trying <laughs> Like what can that thing even do? It's why would you why would you make a tank who can only drill? Like, it doesn't even have a gun. All I have to do is outrun it. Jack in, Mega Man. Execute. So yes, this is the final. Um, the the final World 3 area, um, obviously Drill Man, but again, we're getting really long on time, so again, I'm going to have to cut this one here. So thanks for watching, guys. This has been Pink Reaper, signing out.